It's Black History Month, and it's time for a Black History Minute. At the turn of the centurium, four decades after Lincoln freed us, and four decades before Michael Jackson's sister pulled out her milk wagons for Playboy, as you know, a white man invented the radio, and his name be Marconi. And about ten minutes after Marconi invented the first radio, a black custodian named Macaroni stole the first radio, and it went something like this. I tell you, I am the greatest radio inventor in the whole world. I invent the radio. Listen to this. Now, we're up to our long-distance dedication. And this one is about kids and pets and a situation that we can all understand, whether we have kids or pets or neither. It's from a man in Cincinnati, Ohio. What the, the hell is right. that? I invent the radio to pick up some Arab radio station? What the hell is this? Uh, two, hey, that's the cope. You got the cope right here. Coming up some uh, Jimi Henry, some uh, Led Zeppelin. And uh, this Friday night at 6, it's Gay Rock Rarities Weekend. It's twice an hour all weekend long. We'll venture into the K-Rock vault. Me and my Aunt Italia will drop by. My Uncle Francis. I'm not trying to trade on my brother Nicholas's name. You got the cope right here on 92.3 K-Rock. Hey! That's the cope about 50 years before Tom Chiasano gave him the axe. Hey, these I am a summer nice radio I invent. Oh. I tell you, it's so good, the sound. Well, I call that kind of radio... What the radio hell is shock, this? Uh, schlock shock radio. Most people just call it sh shock. Uh, I've always... I'm a traditional broadcaster. I'm not a conservative guy. I'm kind of a character. Why, I've always for God's looked at radio sakes, I invented the radio for this talentless rug top to get on the air? Hi, I got to break my radio. I love my radio. What am I saying? I'm going to put on a K-Rock at 92.3... Where the hell did my radio go? Where is my radio? Hey, some lousy schwarz has stolen my radio. What the hell is going on here? Where is that guy? Of course, the perpetrator were MB arrested, tried, and served three years in the federal penitentiary. Because that lousy spaghetti head Marconi don't refuse to drop the charges. Be with us next time for another Black History Minutes.